hello guys uh, welcome to my youtube channel in this video we are going to see the va validation form validation in a react using boost trap format and yup so yup is a basically a, a schema based form validation you can go to the uh, their official website uh, i mean github uh, repo so this is the yup official github repo so you will find that um, how uh, validation can be done with the help of yup in our react application so it's a schema based uh, validation in the form so we are going to use yup in our post trap form so in order to set up a uh, boost trap in a uh, react application we need to first install the uh, npm install react boost trap and uh, after that we need to set up this this cds uh, this uh, css file and we need to set up this edn in our index.html file so uh, i have already uh, let me show you the first uh, what we are going to uh, build so this is the application and if you submit the form without entering any value it will show the error message like username is required last name is required sorry first name is required last name is required and user name is required and are must be accepted so this validation we are going to handle with the help of yup so so we need to uh, install three things first this one first this one and pm install react boost trap boost trap then format and uh, yep so we will install this one so i have all already installed so for demo purpose i'm installing again bootstrap yep and for So these three things installed, three things need to be installed. Once they installed, we need to do one thing first. We need to import our boost trap uh, CSS uh, file in our index.html file. Then in index.html file, we need to, I don't uh, we might need to apply that uh, CDN. So let's copy this CDN. So I think either you can do this way or this way. So this is an optional. Okay. No need to uh, paste it in index.html file, it is an optional. So, so it's installing our um, necessary package. And um, I have already installed these packages. For this demo purpose, I'm I'm just going so we can start uh, writing uh, the logic validation, and I will push the code in a repository so it will be available for you, and I will paste the repo link in the description section. So. 
first we need to bring the yuck yuck then we need for me and from react bootstrap we need couple of things like form call column input group and button now we need form first we need to define the schema The same thing will be goes for last name and username and for term we need to specify in different way. Turn yep dot bull required one of we need to give true and the available term must be accepted Now we need to define the formic. On top of that, we need formic. On submit nothing but when you are writing the console dot log we will provide the initial value so first name will be empty in the same way we will do for first name last name and username and term will be false and we need to define the format here closing bracket So you can see something is one minute. Let me start the server again.
okay so after restarting the server it is working okay so let's see so we got all the error the moment you type the error will be gone the moment you select this checkbox this will gone so this is the yep validation uh, in in our react so you can always refer to the official doc so official doc you can always refer for more information about the app so that's it guys from this video i hope you like the video if you like it then press the like button if you like the content then please subscribe the channel thank you so much for watching this video